We are now joined by an Olympic athlete who is so famous that even his towel has a Twitter account. We welcome gymnast Danelle Leva. Danelle, how do you feel about your lucky towel tweeting during the Olympics? <laughs> it's awesome. I mean, I didn't know that it was tweeting. I mean, I, I guess it had something hidden on the floor um, <laughs> while I was going, you know? <laughs> so why is this your lucky towel, and how did this become your lucky towel? And does it have a name? No, it doesn't have a name. It's just a towel. <laughs> um, <laughs> to be honest, it, <laughs> it was... Um, it was actually not supposed to be a lucky towel at all. Mm -hmm. It was. Um, it, it started off as I just need something to wipe, you know, just to keep with me to wipe my sweat off. And one of my aunts went to go buy a towel, and uh, the other one went to her house to go get me a towel. And they both came back with the exact same towel. It was crazy. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, one of them ripped, so I just have the one now, but I've had it since 2007. And it, uh, like I said, it's, it's more than just a lucky towel. You know, it really uh, helps me stay focused. And really? stay like in my zone uh, before before I get up to do anything. Well, now we have a contest. We can name your towel on Twitter, so that'd be kind of cool. There we go. Uh, now, so both the U.S. <laughs> men's and women's gymnastics teams had a very rough start at the Olympics. The ladies rallied to win the gold on Tuesday night, and you came back to grab the bronze on Wednesday night. How hard is it dealing with the pressure of having to rally for a medal? Um, it was definitely not that much pressure for you know like a. Uh, like having to come back it was a lot more of a sense of redemption that needed to be fulfilled for for the, for for us for the guys you know we didn't have uh, the day that we wanted in team finals no one was really shaky or nervous we were we just had an off day you know and mm. uh, it was just very unfortunate that it was on team finals but like i said um this is a, a redemption for 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 everyone so this medal doesn't only go out for for me and my parents and my coaches and family it's for for my team and for everyone back home and in miami and everyone who supported me and the whole latin community all around the world yeah you mentioned the latin community you are of cuban descent is it extra special for you to be winning medals for team usa knowing what your family had to go through to get to america after your mom and stepdad were both members of the cuban national gymnastics team yeah it, it definitely means a lot you know it um it's a it's a huge honor to, to to be able to represent the United States of America and, and knowing that they let someone who wasn't even born there uh, um, do it for them is is amazing. Like I said, it's a huge honor and privilege for me to to be here for the United States, and it's great to know that a Cuban helped them reach a, a bronze medal in the all around. That's great, and it, it really does symbolize what America is all about. Now, I, I got to be honest with you. My dad is from Havana, Cuba, and like most Cubans, he's very affectionate with me, his son, all right? So I got to ask you, with the constant, you know, my dad, with the constant besos all the time, you know, your coach is also your stepdad, and he's constantly planting kisses on you when you compete. <laughs> are you cool with that? Exactly. I'm very cool with that. We're, like you said, you know, Cubans are very affectionate. We're very touchy-feely kind of people, you know? We say hi to someone, I'm like, oh, hey, what's up? Big hug, you know? It's okay. It's, that's how we do it. But with the kisses, though, he's he's kissing you all over your face and the whole thing. I mean, you know, I mean that you got dad. Well, he's it's, my it, dad. You know, it's easy, all easy right. with the kisses. Maybe a hug. Maybe a handshake. Okay. <laughs> maybe a hearty shoulder clasp. That's but all right. I, I don't need the God, the basis of the way it's all they're all wet all over my face and the whole thing. Uh, so tell I don't know, man. I don't know. I think you're. I think I'm. I'm sensing a little bit of is jealousy. It, I think you mean? want some of my dad's kisses too, man. <laughs> You're reading into it, and I love you for that. Uh, all right. Good luck the rest of the way in the Olympics, and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you very much.